Oh, uh, hello. I didn't see you there. Mm, don't mind me. I'm just blowing things up. It's relevant. I promise it will all make sense in a moment. Well, I am happy to announce that as of October 2nd, 2024, we now have a stack. Okay, so I know my channel is tiny, and it might seem odd to celebrate such a small milestone, but it's Minecraft, so the number 64 is pretty significant. So I thought it would be interesting to make a special video to highlight just how important you guys are as viewers and subscribers, and to do something a little bit interactive. But first, if you are new here, let me quickly introduce you to my channel and its content with a short 60 second montage. It's, um, it's here somewhere. Uh, let me, let me see, I'll find it, uh, okay, here we go. And here at the uh, black wool, this is where we reach a light level of zero. And you'll notice that this essentially creates a diamond shape. So this is the pattern of light that we'll be able to see on the ground. As you can see, we have quite a big area of coverage with light here, and we didn't have to place a lot of torches. Wow, that hit me? Okay. Oh my gosh. What the heck was that? I don't think I can save you, though. You built it on a lava pool. Oh, the kid's on fire! Oh, that's terrible. Still with me? Good. Recent response on the channel has been super supportive, and I'm incredibly grateful. So, for all of you who managed to find your way here and choose to spend your time with me, I want to incorporate that into my gameplay as a means of thanking you. If you leave me a comment on a video in the month of October, or even if you already have, I'm going to rename a diamond block after you and use it in an upcoming build. If you join in and comment in November, um, I'll get you an emerald block. And even if you make it in by the end of December, I'll honor you with a block of gold. Lastly, for the handful of viewers who have left such great supportive comments, I'll be toiling away in the nether mines to craft you a block of netherite. For those of you who might still be new to Minecraft and join me due to the guide series, just know that blocks of netherite are one of the game's major flex items, as it takes finding 36 pieces of a rare nether ore, plus a few additional steps just to make a single block. And then, as soon as possible after New Year's, I'll either use the tribute blocks to decorate a brand new base in my overworld, or design a new unique island in the Arc Dimension to showcase them on. Feel free to offer suggestions if you've seen the areas I'm working on, and this way, if I am lucky enough to continue growing this channel, you guys who were here early on will have the prestige of being a part of the content that I'm building. So again, thank you for all your support. And welcome to all the new viewers and subscribers. There's a real chance that in the time it takes me to record and edit this video, we're well past a stack. And before I head out, I'll go ahead and take the opportunity to offer a real brief channel update. It's clear that the Caves Notes guide series has been largely well received, and I've been pleasantly surprised at the result. Viewers are the reason that we have content, and it's fantastic to be able to help other players as well. So, Caves Notes will continue to be my primary format for the foreseeable future, at least until we get through the dozens of topics that can be covered. I always drop at least one episode per week, and sometimes more. The weekly video will always be on Friday, US Pacific Time. I am still hard at work on the Arc Dimension. I'm really enjoying that project, but each episode easily takes dozens of hours just for the project itself. So I'll be working those in between guide videos, and I don't have a set schedule for them, but they will continue. Likewise, shorts are generally videos of opportunity, 
something funny happens, or I have a random idea that can be rapidly executed, that kind of stuff. There's some news that YouTube is going to be allowing shorts up to three minutes long starting this month, so I'll be doing those from time to time as well. I do also have some footage from server play. I've been heavily considering releasing it as its own sort of bare bones, super lightly edited series. I don't really expect much viewership from it, but it might be interesting just to include on the channel. Now please feel free to tell me your own thoughts on that. Lastly, I would love to start streaming on YouTube, but I have to grow my subscriber base first. I have an interesting idea for a hardcore challenge that I'd like to do live. Let me know if that is something you'd look forward to, or if you would, would just rather pass on it. And that's it! As always, thank you for watching, and thank you for joining me on my YouTube journey.